Hey YouTube, what's going on? I'm Seven King here with another Camtasia Studio 6 tutorial. Uh, first, before we get to the tutorial, I want to direct you to my wallpaper. As you can see, it says BMN Tutorials, T U T S for abbreviation. Uh, BMN is Mr. Meets Nick. Those who don't know him, he's um, pretty much the same thing I do here. Uh, review talk tech all over YouTube basically you can look up look him up on YouTube Vista meets Nick look at his channel page um, subscribe to him it's really cool he actually made this wallpaper that I have right now I thought I'd um, try it out give it a shot see how it looked on my uh, desktop it doesn't look bad he makes all these wallpapers um, you know custom created design everything by him He's got more. This is the one that I decided, you know, it's the only one I got so far. So, um, if you want to check out more, you can actually go to his website, VistaMixNick.com, and see his wallpapers for yourself. But, actually, I'm going to contact him and see what I can do about more wallpapers, see if he's got any more. I know he's got a few more, um, so I'll see what's going on with that. But, definitely check out these wallpapers. They look professionally done. I mean, really, really nicely done. Um... Uh, Okay, now on to Camtasia Studio 6 tutorial. Uh, basically what this is, is what I'm going to be showing you is how to edit the audio in your clips, in your video clips. Um, this can be shot through a camcorder, it can actually be uh, a video that you probably, I don't know, that you did a screen recording with. It doesn't matter what video it is that you're using. I'm just going to go ahead and go into my videos and take a video that I actually shot with my camcorder. <clears throat> Just go ahead and choose this one. Just drag this down this timeline. Now if you've seen my last video, how to upload HD videos on YouTube, you are going to want to go down to your YouTube HD preset and keep aspect ratio. If you haven't watched that, I'll give you a link to that, um, and you can watch it from there. Basically, what this is going to do, I'm going to go into Edit, Audio Enhancements. And this tool here has probably got to be the best that Camtasia has to offer. Um, these are the Audio Enhancement tools. Pretty much this dynamic range control, uh, if you have this selected even out volume levels, this takes every... Uh, big pitch in audio and kind of lowers it down to match everything else so there's no loud crackles or loud pops or anything that may be in the background or may be within you know your audio anything that's in your audio anything huge any spike in audio it's going to you know adjust it lower and level it down with everything else make everything really really smooth um, the second one here is background noise removal if you have any kind of white noise, any fuzzy noises, um, any clicks, basically it's going to get rid of them. It's going to eliminate them altogether. Now you have two choices here. You can automatically try to detect noise on timeline, which actually works very well. Um, and you have manually selected region. If you see any spikes or you know, oh, well this spot has a little fuzzy, you know, you can highlight it and go ahead and click remove noise and it go and it just goes ahead and does it <coughs> really really simple fast quick and I mean here I'll show you how it works I'm gonna go ahead and do automatically try to detect noise in the timeline and just gonna click remove noise now this you can't really see or you can't you can't really hear it and um, mind you this little square is so small it's because I was not recording in the right format so make sure you know if you want to do HD record in the right format or it's going to be really tiny anyways that's besides the point um, you can't hear this but when I go to start the video I push the record button it makes it like a little rally noise in the, in, the, in the video and it picked it up and it got rid of it so I'm going to hit remove noise again and mind you it jumps to certain points in the timeline automatically if it detects something 
and right now that's the only thing it's detecting so I can do manually remove noise if I see any awkward lag or any um, awkward huge spike in the audio I can just go ahead and um, but you have to make sure there's no talking if there's any talking it's not gonna work because it does, it's not gonna remove any anything with voice in it so that's probably why it's not really detecting anything else because there's constant talking through the whole thing and when there's talking going on and you, you don't really notice things like that anyway but um it really does work really really nicely so <clears throat> there's also an option to restore the noise maybe if that was supposed to be in the video um, you didn't want that to be removed you can also choose that option also there's the sensitivity bar low and high so um, it actually that it just explains itself it's how sensitive it is if you have it on high it's gonna detect every little thing if you have it on low it's gonna you know let some things go so depending on how you want to do this you go low or high um, but I use this all the time on my videos that I shoot that I do with my screen recordings <clears throat> and I'll probably even use it for this one um, it's it really does help so this is M7 King uh, do remember to rate subscribe comment because I always appreciate that um, and I hope for all you Camtasia Studio 6 users even 5 I mean if you're still at 5 you know maybe you still got 5 I don't know um, this is gonna work for you too this clip was supposed to be created a little earlier when I did have 5 but you know things always happen but um, I got the video for you right now it's right here hope it helps it's really useful um, make sure you do check out this wallpaper though check out these wallpapers from Vista Meets Nick they're free I mean yeah I doubt he's gonna charge it for a wallpaper I mean it's always good to support Vista Meets Nick in any way so this is M7 King please remember to rate comment subscribe even add me as a friend if you want hey I'm accepting friend requests too so thanks for watching